Two years ago, I weighed 30 pounds heavier. I decided to start intermittent fasting. What's intermittent fasting? It is not eating for prolonged periods. And I chose to eat within a six hour window, which is 8 a.m. until 2 p.m. Today, I'm going to answer the most popular questions I'm asked on an almost daily basis. What do you do in the evenings if your husband is expecting an evening meal and you're not eating? He also practices intermittent fasting, but in a slightly different way to me. I only eat two meals a day and then I don't snack at all after two o'clock, three o'clock every day. But he will eat fruit and nuts and things like that in the evening because one, he doesn't want to lose weight, two, he's already slim, three, he's quite fit, and four, he's a bit of a snacker. Another popular question is, what do you do if friends invite you out in the evening? Well, I will convince my friends to either go out to lunch with me instead, or I'll make them go for a bike ride with me. My poor friend, Helene, she asked if we could go out for a drink together, but she ended up cycling for about four hours with me. What do I eat and drink when I'm fasting? Well, the thing about fasting is you don't eat anything. What do I drink? I drink lots of black tea, lots of water and coffee. Why did I choose eating between 8 a.m. and 2 p.m. instead of skipping breakfast like most people do? Well, the reason for me is that I used to get really bad tummy pains every single night. And I think it's because my tummy was trying to digest food whilst I was sleeping. So I decided that I would have breakfast and lunch and stop eating at 2 p.m. And since I've been doing that, I've had no tummy pains, no indigestion, heartburn, and all of that. Why did I decide to go 100% plant-based? Well, about 10 years ago, I had a medical scare. I had a health scare. And I vowed to find out how to heal myself if I was sick, and if I wasn't sick, how to ensure that I didn't get sick. So, all roads led to a plant-based diet. How do I manage social occasions if I do have to go out in the evening if it's somebody's birthday? Well, normally I have a good size breakfast and a good size lunch and I don't eat in the evening. If I do go out in the evening, if it's a social occasion, maybe it's someone's birthday, I would have a smaller lunch and then I would have a very small evening meal. So I can go and socialize, but I just wouldn't eat too much. It's that simple. If I was eating only plants when I gained weight, how did I gain weight? Well, I gained weight because I was drinking too much, I wasn't moving enough, and I was basically eating too many calories. You literally only have to eat one apple too many a day and you're going to gain weight. How often do I practice intermittent fasting? Well, I aim for every day, but if there's a day, maybe a Saturday, where I fancy a snack in the evening, then I'm not gonna deny myself, I will have a snack. But it's really, really easy for me to practice intermittent fasting because I don't have to think about food for a third time every day. I don't have to think about what to eat. Uh, food was a little bit of addiction for me, so the fact that I only have to think about it twice a day means that I can enjoy my food for those two meals that I have, and the rest of the day I can be doing something else and not thinking about food. Another good question was, how quickly did I lose the weight? Well, I tell you what, losing weight, intermittent fasting, was the easiest thing I've ever done. The weight fell off me and I lost 28 pounds within about four months. My biggest problem now is to ensure that I eat enough to maintain my weight. I don't want to lose any more weight. I just want to build some muscle. How do I make sure that I don't feel hungry during my fasting hours? I eat tons of plant fiber. This is my green juice that I'm having for breakfast today. I'm happy to answer any questions. So if you enjoyed my video today, don't forget to hit the like button, give me a follow, and of course, share me with your friends.